as we walk this way towards the coach, we're gonna start on the exterior, show you some fun features, what's new for this year, some options, and um, then we'll obviously work our way into the interior of the coach. So before we get too far, I'm gonna go ahead and point out this right here. So as I mentioned, it's our base star 3811. So the 38 here is going to be the length of the coach, and the 11 is going to be our floor plan. This coach is gonna be one of our uh, class A gas coaches built on a four chassis. It comes with a uh, eight V8 engine. And then as we move this way a little bit, something that you guys will notice is going to be our exterior paint here. So this coach actually gets our clear coat finish. And for this year, the Basar has one rollover exterior graphic and two new. So featured here is one of our new exterior graphics called the Gable. Obviously it's a lot of blues. It's very eye catching on the road. Just something very cool to have when you're uh, obviously traveling through the mountains or the, through the campgrounds. So as we're here, I'm gonna go ahead and point out this. So this is going to be an option. This does not come standard on this coach, but it's going to be an exterior entertainment system. So it's gonna be a 32 inch Samsung TV. And that's just gonna obviously be controlled by a um, remote here. And then if you wanna go in here as well, you're gonna have a couple USB ports if needed. And we'll just go ahead and keep this open just for fun. As we work this way, I'm gonna go ahead and point out that they also optioned in our Truma water heater system. So essentially that means it's going to give you continuous hot water and it's also gonna go ahead and prevent scolding water from you. And it's also gonna have hot water for a little bit longer rather than what comes standard on this coach. And as I mentioned earlier, this is going to be our wheelchair accessible coach. So you're gonna see this massive door right here. I'm gonna go ahead and demonstrate how this opens and closes and it's gonna be powered just with this little remote. So this door is gonna open super smoothly for you. It has, um, obviously we're gonna show you, I wanna show you on the inside how this comes out, but if you're out here, there is going to be a remote control that you use to unfold it, fold it, bring it down and bring it back up. And this is going to have a 800 pound capacity lift as well. And we're gonna go ahead and shut it for you. Easy peasy, let's walk this way. So now I'm gonna go ahead and take you around the exterior of the coach. And as we're coming back here, we're gonna to get to our um, rear end. And so this rear ladder is actually an option. So this does not come standard with the coach, but it is isn't available to you. And for whatever reason you need it, you need to get access to the roof. That's something that is available to you as well. As you can see, moving to the off door side here, we're gonna have both of our slide outs out from our living room and our bedroom. And I'm gonna go ahead and point out a couple bays for you. So underneath here, obviously it'll be easier if this is in, but we'll go ahead and show you now. So opening this one up, it's going to be our um, power rewind cord. So essentially if you are in the mountains or you're at a campground and you need to plug into a, one t or a 110 uh, outlet or just anywhere you know on the ground, that's gonna go ahead and come out. That's what you're gonna use to plug in. And then super nice for you, you don't have to manually reel that in. It's gonna have a power button and it's super easy and convenient. Closing that one up. Working our way from that power cord reel, we're gonna go ahead and open this bay for you. So this is gonna be where your water work system is. So opening this up, you're gonna have your outside shower if you wanna use that. It has a little portable head there. This is also gonna be where your water tanks are, your sewage rinse and um, fill. So just wanted to point that out so you knew where that was. And obviously if you wanted to take an outside shower, if you've been out on the hiking or sandy all day, that's there for you. And then we're gonna go ahead and move down this way. I just like to show you where your batteries are at because we get a lot of questions on that. So it's just super easy for you guys to see. And that's gonna go ahead and be in this compartment right here. So you're gonna have uh, two batteries right here for you. So if you ever need anything replaced or if you can't find them, they're right here on this uh, second bay on the off door side. And that pretty much finishes it up for the exterior here. I'm gonna go ahead and take you around to the other side and we're gonna head inside. 
Now we move inside the 3811 Bay Star. So a couple features I want to point up here in the cockpit area next to your driver and passenger seats is first off, this is going to be a two-tone dash color. Obviously you can see your black and your creams. And then your accents are actually going to need to be a carbon fire dip this year, which is new for this year, which is exciting. And it has a really nice and clean look to it, in my own opinion. And then as we focus here, obviously you can hear the radio on a little bit. So we're going to go ahead and just turn that down for you. Just wanted to kind of demonstrate that obviously it works and you can hear everything. Speaking of hearing, so we're going to have our JBL sound system around here, which you can see up here, which is our premium auto. And then I'm just going to go ahead and point out um, our owner support here. So in every one of our Newmar coaches, you're going to have a specific brand specialist. So over here, you're gonna see um, a gentleman who's been with Newmar for many years. Um, our tenure here at Newmar actually is something we pride ourselves in. Most people, you know, minimum it's eight plus years that they're here with Newmar. So obviously they didn't know the ins and outs of the coach and your brand specialist is gonna be specific to your brand. Um, so whoever that may be, if you have any problems, 24 seven service, which is incredible. Not many manufacturers do that. Uh, Newmar prides ourselves on that. So if you have any issues anytime in the night, obviously you're camping, you're living in your home, whether that's full-time or part-time, you're gonna need someone that's gonna be there to help you. We have that. So now as we move into some technical things here. So up here, you're gonna have your electronic stability control, your cruise control, and then something new for this year is gonna be our Nav and Go navigation system. So that go that removes um, our Randy McNally system and the Nav and Go system actually has vehicle dimension capabilities this year as well, which is super cool. So that's something that's nice for this year. Obviously you have all your little nicks and gadgets up here. You have, you know, your 12V outlet if needed. And uh, obviously you can customize this with different options. But I'm gonna go ahead and point out over here on our passenger side. So if you are driving in the passenger seat, which I'll sit down for you, you actually have a workstation here. So let's just say you wanna read a book or you wanna enjoy a beverage up here, but you don't wanna leave your driver alone. You can simply just go ahead and pull up this table and you have a workstation, which is super nice. And let's say you have an actual workstation, you want to actually do work and have a laptop or a computer in front of you. There's going to be some USBs down here and a 110V outlet as well. And now I'm going to go ahead and focus on our main living area. So something I want to point out too is our furniture this year is going to be new Williamsburg furniture, which is actually handmade here in Napanee, Indiana, which is close to Newmark. So as we move this way he over here, first I'm going to point out this cabinet. This cabinet is going to be one of your friends. So this is going to have anything you need from your power control system, your awning control, your lights for your awning, your battery disconnect, your generator, um, any tank heat pads, uh, and then it's also going to have your slide outs over here as well. So this is going to be something that you're going to become very familiar with in your coach. Since we're over here, I'm going to go ahead and point out this beautiful fireplace. So this actually does not come standard in our base there of 3811, but it is an option available to you. So the fireplace is optioned in, as I just said, along with the televator, which I'll demonstrate in one second and our Bose sound bar here. So I'm gonna move my way over here because this is where our televator button's gonna be. So as I just mentioned and pointed out our televator and Bose sound bar over there, I wanted to go ahead and demonstrate it. So let's just say you're sitting here relaxing on your couch and you decide that you wanna watch some TV. So there's gonna be a click button so you don't hold it. It's just gonna simply click up and that televator is gonna come up over here. Super smooth, looks really slick. And it's obviously very convenient as that can be hidden as well. And that way you have a little bit of counter space if you want to add anything over there as well. So just drawing your attention back over here, as you can see, I'm sitting on our standard jackknife sofa. This is actually gonna be a sleeper if needed. So this does pull out. I will go ahead and demonstrate that for you. So just bear with me. <laughs> as I'm moving things around here, I'm gonna go ahead and just keep talking to you. So this has a Velcro attached back here along with this one. These actually stay attached in the middle. So it's super easy to just fold up 
they attach there. And we're just gonna go ahead and put them over here on the table for a second, just for demonstration purposes. And then this is gonna go ahead and fold out for you. Obviously, we just demonstrated how our jackknife sofa can turn into a sleeper bed for you if you have extra company or just need a little bit of extra room. So as we're talking in here, I'm going to go ahead and point out that they went ahead and chose our one of our standard decor packages, which is going to be the gable decor, which matches our gable exterior paint outside. So moving in again, these cabinets are going to be our standard Calypso maple, not finish, which are really nice. You can get in here under the light and see the detail here with the really pretty um, stainless steel handles. I'm just going to go ahead and continue to move this way. And now bringing you to our main eating area. So this is going to be our booth dinette with one table leaf. So underneath this is actually going to have a ton of storage. If we want to come down here, pull out these cabinets. super wide and deep and there's going to be another one on my side as well and something I'd like to point out is you actually have um, some capabilities here with the dinette table so this is going to be able to go up down in or out so we'll go ahead and go in and out and we'll go ahead and do um, our up and down as well so there you go perfect I'm gonna go ahead and point out over here as well. So this table obviously comes with our booth. It's gonna come with one folding chair if you need a little bit of extra room or if you have extra people. And then over here, it's gonna be a roll-in space as well. I'm gonna go ahead and get up and show you something here really quick, so just bear with me. This table leaf, leaf is actually um, bendable. So I'm gonna go ahead and fold down a little black lever here. That just gives you a little bit of extra space up front if you need it. And then it just simply pops back up. And we're going to go ahead and just focus our attention here on your kitchen area. So we're going to have our solid surface countertops. You're going to have um, a undermounted stainless steel sink. There's actually going to be two of them and they just are retractable. Again, there's another one underneath there. We'll go ahead and keep that open for video purposes. You're going to have your faucet. Tons of storage up here, storage below, and then you're also going to have the Suburban Elite Reburner cooktop here as well. So this is foldable, which is convenient. It can just stay up there as you're cooking. So actually something that's standard for this coach is going to be the microwave underneath. It's going to be a convection microwave. So what was optioned for this one is going to be the Whirlpool microwave above our uh, Suburban Elite cooktop here as well. So as we just focus our way this way, I wanna go ahead and point out our flooring. So this was also optioned in, it's going to be our tile vinyl flooring, and it's actually again an option to extend it into the bedroom. It is an option to not have it extended into the bedroom, but for this uh, floor plan sake, we do have it here. And then um, moving over here, you're gonna go ahead and have your Whirlpool fridge. So this unlocks and locks. So we're gonna go ahead and unlock it and open it up for you, along with our freezer. So this is an option to um, have the ice maker in here as well. So I'm gonna go ahead and close it and lock it. Obviously, if you're going down the road, you don't want that coming out on you. And right next to your walk are your uh, refrigerator is going to be your washer and dryer. This does not come standard, but it is an option available to you if you would like. And one of the main factors of this wheelchair accessible coach is going to be our Bronability um, wheelchair lift. Bronability is actually one of the leading wheelchair lift in the company, so we're obviously going to use the best because we pride ourselves on being the best. So we're going to go ahead and demonstrate this for you. So again, you have your uh, remote control which controls the door open and close again it's power so it's easy this can all be used by one person so you have your remote control to open and close your power door and then you're going to have your remote to go fold unfold 
and up and down. So we're gonna go ahead and unfold it for you. And you're just gonna go all the way until you hear that click. So what I'm gonna do for you is I'm actually gonna go ahead and step out onto that. Again, it holds uh, 800 pound capacity. So if you are in a wheelchair, you can go ahead and roll out there and take it down by yourself. Again, it's all easily used by one person. So let's walk out here. I'm gonna have the hold onto the remote and we're gonna go ahead and go down. down that front's gonna unfold for you you can uh, roll out and be done and then let's say you need to come back up roll back onto the lift and we're gonna come back up and as I talked about that is again going to fold back up so you it locks you in you don't have to worry about going back or going forward that's going to fold back down for you and we are going to come back in and now you're simply just going to fold it back in for you there you go and again something i'd like to point out is this is an option here so it's actually going to be a screen door so if you want to you know leave that open get a little fresh air this can come in lock into place or you can simply just leave it open like that perfect so now we're going to go ahead and head into the bedroom here moving our way in here so you have a rollable under sink and you're also going to have a rollable shower here so again you're going to have your solid surface countertops a stainless steel undermounted bowl you're going to have cabinet storage in here there's also some outlets under here, the 110B outlets. And then let's say you're ready to take a shower. You can simply roll in or hop onto this foldable shower seat if you wish. Otherwise that can be popped up as well. Perfect. We're gonna head this way. Now we work our way into the master bedroom here. So you're gonna notice that there's a ton of room right here, which is super easy for anyone that does have a wheelchair and needs to roll a little bit closer to the bed. But something I want to point out is the reason this is so large is because we actually went ahead and decreased the size of the shower this year. Um, if you do want, you know, an increased shower size and a little bit of smaller room, so you don't need it as much, that is an option available to you as well. But speaking of the space over here, you're going to have a nice tall board here, plenty of storage, a hanging rod, shelving up here. And then the main feature of this bedroom is going to be the bed. So for the base R3811, there's actually going to be three options available to you. So you can have your standard full-size bed height, you can have a fixed and lowered bed frame if needed, or what this one features is going to be our power adjustable bed, which has our glide away mechanism as well. So I'm going to go ahead and point out this remote to you. So let's say you purchase this coach, you're going to get a remote just like this. So you're going to have an anti-snore button, you're going to have a flat if you want to lay it flat. And there's going to be a ton of different options here for lowering and heightening your head or your legs as well. Um, I know a lot of people, you know, sometimes I have knee surgery and my legs need to be elevated for um, blood circulation. So that is available to you as well, which is super cool. So I'm going to go ahead and show you a couple things here. So. Over here, super easy, next to you on the bed, is going to be the bed lift. So you can go up and down. And then again, you're gonna have this. So if you want to adjust the height in any shape or form, that'll pull up for you. Let's go back down. We'll see if this one will do it for us. This one brings your legs up a little bit more. So there's just a ton of fun features back here that are super convenient for the customer. So whatever you're most comfortable in or whatever your health needs are, this bed is made for you. 
Again, that is an option. It does not come standard, but it is available to you and the customer. Moving to this side of the bedroom here, we're going to go ahead and point out our upper cabinets here. So it's going to have storage space, but if you have any kind of sleeping machine or something that needs plugged in, both of these are going to have two 110V outlets available to you. And it's actually going to be a small thing under here to run any sort of wire underneath, which is super nice. On the side of the bed, you can't see it right now. I'll move out of the way. But right there on that cab cabinet, there's gonna have a uh, front 110V outlet and two USBs as well. And as we move to this side of the coach here, you're gonna have your egress window, your Samsung TV, and then you're gonna have a ton of storage and again, another ward right here with plenty of shelves. And there's also gonna be another outlet up there as well for you. I want to thank you for coming on this journey with me to explore our 3811 Base Star. This is our wheelchair accessible coach and I wanted to think of the perfect place for you which is why not right here. This is the whole purpose of the video and again as I mentioned before this is all completely accessible and easily used by just one person as you saw. I got on, I got off, and it's going to be easy for you. So if you have any questions don't hesitate to reach one of our Newmark dealers, call Newmark Sales, and again, my name is